What's up, guys? Today we are going. I'm going to do a review on my God's Real toy. I don't even know uh, what year this was made in. Because uh, this uh, I I can only do a review since on the unboxing. I can't I can't do an unboxing since this was, I got this right before. I literally I'm pretty sure this was before. I even had a YouTube channel. I have a I've had a YouTube channel for like a couple of years. So yeah. Uh, this is a Bandai one. So let's so first let's see the articulation of this. So you, the tail is movable. It has like this like uh, something inside of it. And the arms you can move the head. Eat. All right. Uh, you could the dorsal plates they kind of like move but it's not supposed to do that it's just like the plastic um the paint on this guy it's pretty awesome like the paint in the mouth is 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 epic the paint on the eyes is epic uh nothing went bad with the paint job uh, on the points of its toe, there are little pieces that they're not gonna paint it, but that's just like a tiny piece. Like, if you look at it like this, you don't see it all, but you go like this, yeah. So, so let's actually give him a size comparison. So, here's it, here he is. We have Shin Godzilla, yes. He's tall. Okay, so these guys, I'd say this guy's probably bigger. My Nekoshin Godzilla. His Millennium Godzilla, which if you haven't seen that video, uh, you can go watch it now. Here is um, the Bandai uh, King Ghidorah. Here's the Bandai Legendary Godzilla. Let me just move his tail. Dude, this guy is way bigger than he, This guy is one of my biggest um, ones. This is one of this guy is one of probably one of my biggest. Except the biggest one I have is the giant size Godzilla. And last but not least, we have Mecha Godzilla, which is bigger, of course. Wait, no, not last, but so this one's the last one. Last but not least is my brand new. Just made a video on it. Mecha King Ghidorah. So, yeah, this guy, I got this guy a couple years ago and I decided why don't I make a review on him? Since I, I never even did an unboxing. I probably, I'm pretty sure it's because I had this guy, I had this guy. This guy is one of my, probably my second, my er, no, my third ever got the toy because the first one. Nah, that's my, yeah, my second one. Because my the first Godzilla toy I ever had was my legendary Nether Godzilla, which my dog ate. So this is my uh, second ever toy that, that I ever got. The third one was probably, I'd say, this dude. And I got this guy from Christmas. Then is when I got the giant size legendary Godzilla, which was... Huge. Yeah, the size comparisons. This dude is probably one of my smallest ones. I think he's probably taller than Millennium. I'm gonna put him as high as he can stand up. Okay, yeah, this guy is taller than Millennium. He has like a little bump on his head, which makes him taller. And this Neko Shin Godzilla, yeah, the Bandai Shin Godzilla is probably bigger, but the Neko one, compared to this dude, wait. Okay, he's actually bigger. And the tail is just huge. But I did a review on Chimbo's already. Uh huh. So yeah, this guy's pretty cool. The paint and all that. It looks like it has glitter. I don't know why. Because like, like it has like a little piece of glitter on it. So, yeah, this was one of my first Godzillas, and it's and it's like the original Godzilla. 
but the first one that I ever created, I'm pretty sure it was 1954. This dude was made after 1954. It was not, not it's, I think he's also after 1962. I used to think this guy's Godzilla because in Godzilla Monsters Awaken, which is a game of Godzilla, they had a oh, Heisei Godzilla, and I thought I called this guy Heisei Godzilla because this guy looked um, what's his name? This dude looked exactly like Casey got though. Like, identically. Wait, what's the word I'm saying? Identical to the Casey got in the game. But it turns out it's Casey got in the game was he's like gray. And, but in real, in the like <coughs> toys, not gray, he's like black. Um, shout out to Pull the Wool. Um,. Uh, make sure you subscribe to him on YouTube. Um, anyways, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Peace! Yeet!